Alright, what is up amigos? I hope you guys are doing well and having a fantastic day. So today is Sunday. I vlogged last week. But I actually honestly completely forgot to edit the video because I was really really busy. Uh, and right now I'm going to going up I'm gonna be going up in the mountains and then I saw a little bit of bikers and I'm gonna do a vlog for you. Those of you who are new or watching my channel, this is my 2020 Yamaha R6. So yeah, it's going to be a beautiful day. Um, it's kind of windy uh, and also at the same time, it's one of those days, especially on Sundays, you just want to get out. Uh, you just want to stay home. You don't want to stay home, you know what I mean? Like, I'm really, really excited. It's been exactly a month of my, um, a month of being a, uh, I mean, sorry. It's been a month of it's. It's been exactly a month that I've been in an accident. Uh, I feel good. I honestly feel really good, but obviously the pain. Uh, sometimes I can't get rid of it. Um, still going. I have to call to my insurance and uh, start the physical therapy. That's something that I'm really, really looking forward to. Uh, that's something that I have to do. Most of you know if you've been involved in a car accident. You have to do these things. You have to take care of your body because the healthy mind, healthy body, and then you accomplish your goals and everything. And you know, it, it just rhymes like that. So other than that, let's just hope that this can is open. Oh, what is that? Is that a hawk? I don't know. I think so. Let's just hope that this can is open so we can go up there and talk about our May goals and uh, April goals and what we have accomplished so far. So let's see. Oh, it's not a cool start. So, but I know we all love. Oh, here we go again. This second gear change. It always gets me. Oh, well, I'm going to eventually conquer it one day. But another thing, as far as April goes, is it just me or this month went by really, really fast. Honestly, it's absolutely insane how this year is going so fast. Sometimes I feel like I'm battling with the time. Which I should not be feeling that way. <laughs> okay, okay, the mountain is open. This is a mountain that I honestly have missed. Oh, here goes the gang. There's a lot of bikers. Uh, I don't know if they're going up or they're going down. I have to watch out. I think this is a crew that I always come across, honestly. Uh, I think they come here quite often. So if they come up here, I might have to pull on the side because uh, they're pretty advanced. Uh, I see them sometimes, like they ride together. Uh, they seem like an advanced level of riders and knowing me, I mean, I'm barely conquering this uh, Gondora mountain here. I'm, I, I'm, I'm honestly getting a little bit more comfortable, so I'm not that rusty here. I kind of know the rope here. So I might just pull over later on, like by the time they get here, so I'll watch on my mirror. Cause you know, I kind of want to watch them and I want to learn from them too and you don't want to block them. But yeah, I feel really good honestly. My confidence is back a little bit when it comes to riding. Uh, I feel really good because the thing is, I kid you guys not, like after my accident, that my first ride, I didn't mention it as much. But it was horrible. Honestly, it was horrible. And nobody wants to listen to negative talks, you know? It was horrible. Uh, I, I, I absolutely hated it. I didn't want it to do it. Um, it, my, it affected my confidence in many levels. And you know, with biking, like, when you get hit on a car accident, like, I mean, thank God I wasn't hit when I was on my bike. It could have been beyond bad. But when you get hit on a car accident, especially when you're a rider, it can affect you. It can affect you in many ways. So. I'm gonna 
over. Yeah, so. Yeah, okay. I gotta let them go, you know? Um, but yeah, it's very, very interesting. Uh, knowing that advanced level of oh riders, you know, I don't like to block them. I want them to go. But um, yeah, so going back to the confidence level, you know, um, it was really bad, honestly. It was really, really bad. Uh, it was tough to even be on the road because it just affects you, you know. And it, you don't want to be. You want to be that guy that's working on his writing skills and trying to get better uh, but other than that I hope you guys are having a wonderful day a wonderful week and also accomplishing your goals because April is almost over and May is around the corner and I wanted to know what are you guys' goals is there anything you guys are accomplishing is there anything that you guys are working on uh, please let me know uh, let me know let me know and also I forgot to tell you guys this dealership that I bought a more motorcycle from they've been sending me emails it's like they want this bike it's like in high demand I don't know about you guys but please let me know if some of you who bought a Yamaha R6 if your bike is in demand or do you get these emails or just to see if you're gonna buy another bike from them I'm, I'm pretty sure that has to do with it too but as most of us know they're not going to be making the Yamaha R R6 anymore uh, it has officially ended but um yeah so let me know if you guys are going to be buying their motorcycles or getting into bikes uh, what are your plans for summer and especially May because literally after May is June you know it's half a year June July August next thing you know 2021 is over uh, another thing is I'm really happy that a lot of the population I mean second thing that I'm happy about that a lot of population uh, when it comes down to uh, C virus uh, people are getting uh, vaccinated you know it makes me really really happy because it's really really important it's really important get people vaccinated but it's absolutely one of the best feelings honestly to get your road confidence back because I kid you guys not it really sucked <laughs> to be not at that level and I want to welcome all the new subscribers to my channel I want to thank each one of you for watching subscribing uh, liking my videos and you know just helping one another so if you're uh, someone new to the channel into sports bikes want to learn about sports bikes um, you know just grow together this is where you need to be I looked at the last but not least uh, most of you watch me on my previous vlogs you know you can check it out I talked about the suit and the exhaust but honestly at this point I really want to get the exhaust first the exhaust that I'm looking for completion works uh, it was out of stock uh, I always buy my stuff from revzella.com I really trust them a lot and uh, they're amazing I was gonna go buy it from them but uh, uh, it was just uh, out of stock I guess it's in high demand so I'm gonna go ahead and I believe I'm gonna go pull up trigger with the uh, exhaust first because these drivers California man it's pretty bad it's pretty bad when it comes to the safety level and everything like they don't really pay attention so I honestly need that loud exhaust to make sure uh, I don't feel bad so they know to be careful and like keep an eye on us uh, keep I mean keep an eye on us so they can have they can hear you coming you know I believe it's really important I have to do it for my safety anyway but other than that you know thank you very much for watching thank you very much for subscribing 
enjoying this content and uh, I'll catch you guys on the next vlog the next vlog is gonna be uh, interesting hopefully it's gonna be a little bit more sunny and uh, we will talk about other things so don't forget to comment below about your main goals or possibly if you're willing to buy a motorcycle or a sports bike or a Harley let me know in the comment below uh, and I'll catch you guys on the next one Peace.